Hey guys, so let me just move you back a little bit. There you go. Um, I am working with a 18 by 24 inch canvas. I have coated it with a nice coat of Artist Loft White and we're gonna have a go at a Ninja Swipe, but I thought of something a few minutes ago and <clears throat> I want to give it a try. I don't know how it's going to turn out, but we'll see. So I'm going to do some gold. This is the 24 karat gold. <laughs> I don't know what possessed me to do that, <laughs> but I don't know. I thought it was fun. I do like the outcome. Anyways, what do you think about that? What a mess. I just wanted to try that. I actually had some white paint left over on my hand from tipping and I went like that and it splattered everywhere and I was like, oh, I really like that. And I really like it. So probably not going to do a ninja swipe, obviously. I actually really like this just the way it is. So I just pour some in my hand. We'll do a little hint of gold. And we do that. And it bounced off. It went right into the sink. Couldn't have aimed any better for that one. Uh, I love this, it's twisted. It's so cool. Uh, <laughs> well, this was fun. Um, so I, I sort of like doing this. This is totally something I wouldn't normally do and heck, why not, right? You only live once. Have fun with the paint. Got a lot of extra paint on my hand there. Honestly, if you can't have just a fun day every once in a while, then why bother even painting? Don't take life so seriously. It's fun to be
mindless when it comes to the canvas and you guys are all probably like you lost your darn mind woman and uh, yeah maybe but it was fun I think I like this just the way it is call me crazy So this is what I get to work with today. love this this is really really great there's a lot of cells coming up here and cells in here and a little twisty twirl here and there I mean there's lots of details in this piece that I was not expecting I expected more of a splat mess but I'm totally digging this canvas right now Probably thought, oh, she's gonna be reserved. She's gonna do her ninja swipe. She's gonna make it go this way and that way. And and then I just poured paint in my hand and threw it down. And sometimes if you get the coloring right, it works. And I think it worked this time. The only time, the only time I've ever done it. But I'm definitely gonna leave it and I'm gonna definitely, um, Wait for it to dry, and it is definitely going into my show. Unless it sells before that, which is a, a possibility because that has happened recently. Um, but I think it's fun to lose control. And, um, we do these pours and we strive for certain outcomes and when we think that it isn't or when we see that it's not like somebody else's we get discouraged like this darn cloud pour i mean it, it's it can be hard for people to get the cloud pour but i think people are just focusing too much on trying to get it I think people need to enjoy the process. They need to um, just re relax a little. I, d I don't know. I don't mean that offensively um, it, or any offense to anyone at all. I just, I find it as a personal um, view of my own self. Um, when I was striving to get that cloud pour, I would stress out so bad. Um, I'd be miserable if I didn't get it. If, if I didn't get what, let's say, Mel D got or what Gina got or um, what somebody else got that was, you know, that I saw on Facebook that was outstanding. Um, and I got discouraged. And I, you know, just kept at it. But I learned to just let go and have fun. Um, not saying that's always, but you just have to let go and have fun with the canvas. I get paints are expensive. I understand that. I have three kids. I'm a single mom. Three kids. I work full time and I do this on the side. When I sell a painting, it goes right back into um, the bank for, of course, more paints, but I don't um, spend it all. I just 
you know, splurge a little when I make a sale. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if I'm making any sense, but I sure hope nobody took offense when I told them to relax because that wasn't my intention um, to offend anybody. Uh, but okay, anywho, this was my not give a care in the world Wednesday canvas. Maybe we'll do these every week. I don't know. But I felt empowered to just layer the paints in my hand and throw them down on a flooded canvas and go from there. So what we're going to do now, I'm going to tell you real quick. Yeah. Just torch these areas. The cells can come up. I'm loving this. So I have one little sweater hair right here. I'm going to get that off. I'm bring you guys in. And another little sweater here I'm seeing up there. Okay. So yeah, call me call me crazy, but this girl just threw canvas uh, <laughs> threw canvas on paint. Yep. It's gonna be one of those kind of days. <laughs> Um, so, all right, so look at all these details, these beautiful little cell areas. That is the gold and the pearl copper gold that I used. It's by Arteza. Look at that. All the twisted paint. these crazy lines and colors and I love this and there was another one oh yeah 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 I'm all excited about this one right here look at the twirl on that paint and that detail I love it I've gone and lost my mind today. I suppose we could definitely call this one the Mac attack. <laughs> but I love the outcome. I think it's really, really cool. Um, it's definitely different than anything I've done before sorry we we're out of focus there and um, <laughs> have some fun with the canvas have some fun with the paint think up different ways to get that paint on that canvas and uh, you'll create something beautiful so with that I'm going to take my crazy self get ready for work Maybe have another sip of coffee, but I'm not quite sure if I need any. And uh, think about the mess I just made. Have a great day, guys. Bye-bye.